like four or five dudes lined up ready to buy their drinks. Ooh. A guy go to the club. Oh, you ain't got no money. Money, you ain't drinking. So it's just like you on the floor or on a podcast. Exactly, like. Women could just get off, just off a of face, and sa- as sad as it is, that's just the reality of it. We can just get off. Just they look. don't claim to be providers. A lot of the times, they're not going to pr- present that because of the simple fact of the go. matter. If, if it doesn't provider, sell, provide. it doesn't sell right. for for women. It doesn't sell. Like it's women, put it that in that way. If you're a provider, then provide to me a drink. Right. I mean, I guess, um, but right. like for women, it <laughs> doesn't <laughs> sell. So uh, for women, she's Wait, not going to sit there. I thought money like, was oh, yeah. important. I thought it was I, personality. I'm talking, now I'm talking your language, though. Oh, sure. What's happening? Oh, you, said it, you said it was important last time. No, I'm talking your language so Ambition. we can you know, get an agreement. <clears throat> I'm just switching my chip right now after call, being called a bitch. Oh, see? It works. Henny Riz, man. <laughs> I'm not going right, to say what you, what you, did you want to say before. Okay. What did you want to say before? I just forgot it's not important anymore. Thank you. Okay, let me bring this thing full circle. <clears throat> this conversation started with the whole Cassie situation, right? With uh, her being involved in some sexual degeneracy with Diddy. And being involved in an abusive relationship, even though he did some deplorable things, she still stuck around for three years after the fact, right? Yeah. Okay. Then I said, yo, do women like that deserve, with questionable past, deserve a long-term guy, that a good man, a dream man? I'm saying no. You guys all said yes. I think a woman's past defines her, and if she has a fucked up past, she doesn't deserve a good future. And you guys don't agree with that, which is, I guess, fine, because you guys are speaking from a female standpoint. But then I said, okay, well, does a homeless man deserve a bad bitch? Some of you guys were saying, no, not really, or questioning it, whatever it may be. And I would argue that a homeless dude is like a, like a, a whore. They both don't deserve a good relationship with the top tier on the other opposite gender. And then you went ahead and said that I'm special. Well, this whole started with generalities. And then you said I'm special, and I asked, well, name what makes you different. special or different, or you're the exception to the rule. And then you rattled off a bunch of things that other women do. And then I went ahead and I said, well, most women have, have this main character syndrome. A lot of you guys do. You're not the only one that's went on here and said that I'm special, right? <laughs> Because, I don't know if you guys have caught on, but I've asked you guys questions and then been able to challenge your logic. You know how I've been able to do that? Who are you talking to exactly? Because you listened. A a bunch of you guys here on the panel. The whole point is... You guys have given statements and I've been able to challenge your logic. Do you know why that is? Because you listened to everything we said. That's a part of it. But it's also because I've talked to a lot of girls, right? Mm -hmm. And believe it or not, you guys are all very similar in how you view things. You have an advantage then on us. That doesn't you have refute, a lot of people and a lot of women. But that doesn't refute the fact that you it's guys are all the same. I don't have a background of podcasting and knowing many people and share a lot of opinions. So that makes you be on top of me. So I'm the subject matter expert then, is what you're trying yeah, to say. Yeah, of course. Okay, so if I'm telling you that you're not special then, because <laughs> I've talked to women that literally have the same worldview that you do. If you will have let me, allow me to finish my whole point, then you will understand. But I got interrupted and called a Stop the cap. <laughs> oh, are you so hurt of that, man? Of course I'm going to repeat it. You let off you with your strongest simple. points. You I'm let off with your strongest points. I'm and the strongest so points hurting. that you gave, I'm faithful, blah, blah, blah. Typically yeah. when people list off their, nowadays, uh, their things, nowadays, they list off honest. the strongest you'll first. You'll be honest. Nowadays, how many women that you've known or that you have talked uh, are faithful women that are not looking for your money? There are how many? Let's say we're being realistic here. Not many. Yeah, exactly. That's why that makes me special. Those few special women. Period. That's that's what my whole point was. If you found that Marini, but then like, you went out with a dude on the yacht. I, I can argue. Money. I can argue that like that's how it should be done. I, I agree a hundred percent with you. Yeah, but that's, then you that's want, the way so it then, should be. So then you shouldn't be. And then I could come up with roles, and then I could go back, come out with a, a good-hearted person that you know that is committed to family, blah blah blah, and all the speech that comes after. But wh- why I'm saying I'm a special is because my heart is pure still. After all, the shit. With two kids, right? Yeah, of course. I mean, I still feel that I can find the right person. I can find the right man. I can Not still be loved. Yacht, what is shut up? No, no, yeah. What are you, you know, mad, bro? If, look, listen, if you were pure and not caring about the kind of shit, bro, don't be on yachts, man. Like, be be what, faithful. No, the dude had a yacht. What yeah, bro, she, she, listen, knew, Chris, he, she knew, man. She's going to find her stalking. man and have a great stalking. life. Stalking. Don't mind them. You're going to be yeah, great. Yeah, because you're 34 and you're Don't mind them, bro. You're going to be great. You need to le- learn to listen. That's to a nurse at 34 gonna, and single with you kids? Need, what? I make enough money to support myself and my kids. Yeah, if I if I have a man, it's because I want to have a partner. It's because I want to have a family. It's because I have to want a, maybe a good figure to my Kids. Congratulations. Exactly. That's what a majority of women want to. Exactly. That's a majority of women. Now. Like this, all I'm trying to say is that you're not as special as you think you are. I am special nowadays. Yes, there's not too many women like that that are not yes, looking for are. your money. 
There's not too many women that are, that won't that won't talk about how much you make a, per month. Question. Ta- trust you, me. You said you're special. But money right? matters to you, correct? You're not going to date a guy that makes less than you, correct? Honestly, the craziest thing about this it. night well, show yeah, is no. that these guys give women all gone. the information yeah. they'll ever need because, to get so the men they want, but they take it values. as insults, so we they fail. Other stuff. All well, the women yeah, that came yeah. to this no, show wish value, they listened honestly. to people no, like not, Myron. If you're going to base your life in money, trust me, Wait, hold on. We have a, you're going to die and you're not going to take anything with you. That's what I always have thought, and it will remain with me. That's The fact is, you are different and special, and your husband still left you. He never loved me. He had another woman. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> so how are you different, bro? So how are you well, different? Well, he didn't. It's, that's not my problem. Yo, some, he didn't it's value me. To a whole other country, that man. doesn't make me. <laughs> bro. That doesn't bro, make me. America? That doesn't Fuck define shit, me. Bro. He took advantage of me as much as he can. That's good for him. Because I loved him. I was giving him myself. Well, that that does suck, though. But yeah, regardless of, of the fact, though, you're not that special. That, that think, doesn't define me. He was not appreciative, which see, is different. isn't it crazy? <sighs> How it's perspectives. We we are, you know, do what we do, etc. We don't run around and call ourselves special, yeah. but like regular girls run around and call themselves special. I'm a king. Yeah, but nigga. that doesn't make me a narcissist. King. Who made you a king? Yeah. Thank you. Exactly. So then why is she different? Oh, I never said. I, I mean, said she's different. Also, you also you notice how she once you said I'm a king, she immediately checked you on that? Instantly. Ooh. But if one of these chicks on the panel said I'm a queen, I mean, you would have said shit. Yep. What do you mean? If one of these girls on the panel said, wouldn't have said shit. Because I've been saying said it the whole time. You never said shit, but when he says I'm a king, yeah, right? Different you go ahead and check him on that. But when the girls say I'm special, blah, 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 you don't check nothing. And that's the reason why you fucking bitches are delusional. You guys never check each other. But like, you know what, man? You to call us bitches. You're really not a queen. I'm yeah, talking in general. Yeah, okay? What kind of man calls women bitches? Like, exactly. are you okay? Like, like, why are you so yeah, angry? You're a bitch. Yeah. Calm down. So, like, you're, like, you're a bitch. <laughs> Number so one, it's a word. Word. number one, I'm speaking in general. It's a word. Number one, I'm speaking. <laughs> uh, I'm speaking in general. If you feel the term applies to you, then get offended, I guess. But I'm speaking in general. Okay. How do you call machismo in in English? I don't know how to say no, that word. How do you call machismo in Spanish? Anyway, going back to what I was saying, I find it interesting. He sarcastically said I was a king. You immediately checked him on it because oh. it's a preposterous claim, I which kidding. I agree with you, by the way. I was kidding. But you immediately checked it. I know, it. and I was too. But she says, I'm an exception to the rule. I'm special. Yeah, I'm <laughs> you guys never <laughs> tell each <laughs> other, you're not special, baby girl. We're all the same. You guys never check each other on this shit. Yeah. You never do. And that's why girls walk around in their grand leisure to go ahead and say the shit that they say, I'm special. I'm an exception to the rule. I'm this. I'm that. But you guys really aren't that much different from each other. Nah. You aren't. And it's okay. I, mean, I can get, I can I can agree with that because um at one point you like you said with her being like you know when you brought out the fact that she's single and mm-hmm. has kids l- realistically dudes kind of be like once they hear you have two kids or <laughs> just kids in general <laughs> It's just like, oh yeah, so you're yeah. basically off the chopping board, baby. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. 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 no yeah. idea how many men I have behind me. me yeah. They, yeah. They, yeah. They, yeah. I don't want to be with them. Yeah. So. Fuck you. No, they want to fuck you. No, no. I'm a. Uh, we, I don't know which baby, woman yes. you're, you're, you're pretty, prone of with which woman raise you, raise you honestly, because that's very. Uh, you're lacking some values oh, right there. Really? Yeah, values. you are lacking values. Yeah, yeah. I don't know how you call call me out, telling me that I'm sleeping with all the men that have behind me. No, no. I said they want to fuck you oh that's true for sure yeah, 100%. So. yes that's fine it's on me to take them or not i know so you can't brag about guys being behind you because they just want to fuck you and pump you and exactly yeah, that's exactly it. that's fine so there's, yeah. there's a song out there that's very dear to my heart and it describes you perfectly in a nutshell you want to hear it you let him hit it raw. You didn't have second thoughts. Now you're a single mom. You're funny, you're funny. Now you're a single mom. You said I'm a head of state. I was happily married. And I, I was still believing love. I still believe in marriage. I, after all, I still believe that there are good men outside. And I'm not going to blame everybody else or generalize old men because of what my ex-husband did on me. Mm -hmm. So I'm not going to say you're wrong, but just for like argument purposes, it's just kind (laughs) of like one of those things to where it's just like... I don't care. You can't think that. It's okay, but... No, you're right. It's like one of those things to where it's just like... Uh, like he said, it just comes off like, oh, every chick has said this. Like we, we, we don't. That's fine. Well. Everybody like, can repeat it. Done, Everybody we, can we say it. Already. That's just yeah. me. So Period. I love her confidence because this, this, I, I this really do. Like, I fuck with this it. delusion. Yeah, is yeah. what it's keeps people no, single. Crazy, Great confidence. No, delusion turns real, dude. <laughs> I'm speaking to reality. Watch me. Watch me getting married again. Watch me having more kids. So 
Just saying. Wait, like I said, you, I fuck with I'm you. just going to be wiser this time. I really, I re, sir, I really fuck with you and I really respect yeah, you. Yeah, you're confident. You're like, 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 sorry, you're like, sorry, I just got behind me and I, she's a man. She dates women. She dates women. She trying to fuck you, man. She trying to fuck you, man. Chill, relax, man. Still a dream, bro. Relax. Listen, Mommy I think it's better for you, though, if you go into the marketplace of dating, just thinking that you're regular, but have the confidence to know that you're special in a way that isn't going to be like... Man, it don't matter, bro. She's 34. She's stuck in her ways. You can't I tell her shit. I have a 27-year-old yeah, yeah, yeah. right now. Bro. And I'm this dating is why, him. Look, and chat, he's more mature than chat, many other men chat. that I have this met. This is why though. you don't date women in their 30s, bro. Yeah, bro. You ain't never so, going to be able to change them. They're going to yeah. have their minds and stuff. 27, 31. It is what it is. They're ingrained in their thing. Date younger girls. I tell you all this shit all the time. This is precisely why. <laughs> they have a worldview that you're not going to be able to change. It, I'm special, nigga, and yes. it's not gonna change uh, off of that, bro. It is what it is. There will be one right. that will but appreciate. I want her to live one. In, in her delusion, though. I have what, a question. What delusion? She's, she's dating a 27 year old. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> he's gonna fuck her and leave her, bro. It's she fun, said that bro. she was single earlier, so clearly she don't take that oh, nigga serious. Really? I have a question. I have a question. Yeah, she knows it too. No. She knows it too. Wait, you don't, don't know me. And she's different. You don't know me. You don't claim them though? Jerome no. 1997 yeah, you know ranted from Rumble says and says I called it at the top of the show. Wait, wait, Ecuadorians huh? are annoying and dramatic. Girl next <laughs> and, to Fresh, oh, there bitch. are millions like you that are more attractive. You'd have a man if you stopped talking. <laughs> WFNF. I mean, he lied though. The reason why, because I don't know if you know this big girl next to you, she was quick to say I'm engaged, right? Mm -hmm. When girls are in relationships, <laughs> right? <laughs> Damn, Mario Petty fuck, is fucked up. This is not Jubilee, bro. It's not Jubilee. Yeah, it's not Jubilee. Yeah, man, she been, she been rude the whole time. Fuck that shit. Girls, I got you. Don't and you get up to, you're I'll free to get up and walk out anytime you want, Biggie. Anyway, <laughs> so, God. like I was saying with her, right? My God. She was quick to say, I'm engaged. Mm -hmm. Why was she quick to say that? Because women flex when they're in relationships with men that they actually like. Yeah. So, the fact that you said you're single tells me that the guy that you're seeing, this 27 year old, y'all are just fucking. It ain't nothing serious, bro. What? No, I haven't fucking with him. Never? No. But so I ranted I'm from Rumble and okay, says, so you don't see him as a viable No man option. wants a single ah? mom. You would have said so I'm talking to someone shut up, if you were talking to someone you like them. Shut up. Oh shut, up. shut up. No, I'm shut, not up. Gonna shut, shut up. up. Shut 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 up. This is lit, bro. Yo. This is niggas watching the show. The niggas watching the show are fucking annoyed with y'all, man. We got 23,000 niggas watching. They're like, bro, like, yo, shut up, bitch. Even they're like, yeah, I, know, I, I applaud the commitment that you have to humiliate women here. But we don't, we don't at the end of the day, you, 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 you humiliate yourselves. Calling I people, let me ask my question though. Calling not people listening to questions, and stuff, interjecting all the time, not, that making not ridiculous nice. comments. Honestly. You know what's crazy? She didn't even talk at all on the show. Let <laughs> 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 <Never talk. laughs> What you got to say? Come on. Yeah, what's your um, thoughts on this? Set them at only fans. <laughs> <laughs> How do you make money? A lot of money. What do you do? Hey guys. What do you post? Get my lip off. I don't post any like stuff like that. Yeah. Not really. No. You sure? Because I stream, so it's more of a personality thing. Wait. Where they get oh. to know me oh. and like have internet boyfriends. <laughs> yes. Oh, okay. Personality. So okay. you stream and then they funnel to like yeah. Am like, and like they what's have your name? Amaraf. What? That goes the top streamer Amaraf. I don't know. Okay. So question. Uh, <laughs> All right. Tell us your. Show us your person. Like you haven't said anything during this podcast. I, I, I'm. I think that's debatable uh, per, that you have a personality. But like, what? What do you? Your thoughts. Yeah. yeah. I mean, there's a lot of different. What like exact things? Is she gonna find love? Yeah. Do you think? At 34, two kids. You think? I mean, there's a chance. Yeah, everyone can. So is yeah. she is she different from any other girl? I mean, every girl's different. In Person a way. A personality, right? Okay. Let's say there's like a hundred thousand <laughs> moms out there with kids. Okay. Is she different? I mean, in that type of statistic, like, then yeah. How? How's she different? Because she's a different person. Like, every person's different. They have their own values and perspective on things. Aren't all men dogs? Um, no. No? <laughs> no? I know some guys that are really good guys. A yeah. lot? A lot, yeah. Fresh, you do a little too much talking, man. She ain't saying shit all day. Okay, huh? um... <laughs> Can I ask my question now? You're trying to smash, man. I will, uh, but you, you so you don't have anything else to ask? What, what do y'all, what do y'all, you guys don't have any comments on what's been transpiring? Hell no, bro. I mean, I haven't really, like, it's been going back and forth. I can't really, like, under even stand what's yeah. happening. Wow. Yeah, well, she's 19, bro. She don't care, man. Okay. Nope. 
No, no, but uh, shout out to her, man. She uh, came down from Orlando and <laughs> one night to here, so yeah. Yeah, it was yeah. a nice drive. At least you could drive. Drive? No, a train. At least you can drive. No, I'm a no. such a good driver. No, she uh, had the train, so. <laughs> Wait, wait, train? Okay. Uh, regardless, though, uh, thanks for your input, which is terrible. What uh, about you? Okay. What I think about, I think women are unique. Like, some women can cook, some women can't. So it all depends on the guy, what you choose, you, that's what you unique? want. Yeah. Cooking? Like, she does only fans. Maybe a guy wants a girl that does only fans. And maybe a guy wants a girl that's a home uh, no, body don't. girl. You know what I mean? You're for sex only. Really? She here a politician, bro. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. For real. Well, she has a question yeah. she's been wanting to ask, no, and I want to hear her question. Fuck a politician, man. She's quite all night, though. The girl next to you, Mar. <laughs> okay, so my question was: Is it true? Like a guy told me this. It was like, um, as a guy gets older, his uh, va- like his basically like the. Motherfucker. Uh. <laughs> bro, hey. how, you, how, you, how you been trying to say I got a question all the time and you can't even talk? No, I don't know. Wait, 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 is she different? Different or special? Is she is she special? Um. Keep it a bean. Well, I don't know her personally. Answer the mic, please. <laughs> but generally, on this con- this conversation, what do you think so far? Well, f- she got two kids. She talks a lot. Narcissist. <laughs> is she different? Narcissist. On yachts. I mean, no. <laughs> That's very very base of you. Is she different? No. So can you tell them to their face that they're average yeah i'm i'm saying it no one here is different Damn. special how do you special sorry how's everybody here is different they're just not special that's fine that's her perspective about it that's how and, I respect it, it. and i respect she ain't it. lying that's fine that's what she thinks about it and i respect it oh you respect i think it. i'm special so you respect her but you can't respect him. i think i can yeah, do yeah, many bro. other things that other <laughs> yeah, women the whole time probably she, don't do like giving my life for my husband like being you know selfish not selfish that's that's me Okay. That's standard, I, though. I, no, nowadays women want to be e- right. not even equal. Sometimes more than the man. Well, I'm have, willing to give up. For you my have man. two kids, so you have to do that extra. I'm yeah, doing it. I'm doing it no, right no, now. Extra though. What do you mean? You have baggage. I have. That's that's you're fine. Like, you're like two <laughs> Emotional damage. No, yeah, of course. I'm around. taking care of my kids. Like that's yes. heavy, heavy ball sacks to carry around all the time. That's good. That's fine. Yeah. That's all, all right. right. What what are you? Two niggas you, balls. All right, fresh. What? I all don't fresh. understand. You what? Exactly. All right. All right. Fresh. What's your make a point what was, of it? What was your, what was your question <laughs> that you want to ask? Just mentioned about the balls. I'm like, what the hell? What was your question that you want to ask? Hopefully, you have your thoughts gathered this time. Right. Why I had, why you gotta bump me like that? Okay, basically the Bro, question was. You've been struggling was, to talk the whole yeah, time. Yeah, motherfucker. Uh, <laughs> uh, I, got, I got a question. Uh, 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 I got a question. Oh and then we. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, I want to hear it. Yeah, nigga, uh, Let me ask the question. Uh, <laughs> all right, go ahead. Okay, so I heard. Okay, is it true that guys like um as they get older that the women that they seek out are basically younger than them? Like, is that like a accurate perspective? Like. As a guy gets older, like the woman he sees or the woman he's dating <laughs> is like, you're like, so horrible. It's like younger, Sorry. like. Wait, 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 wait. I need water. I need water. Yeah, me too. I need water. I'm That's camera angle, man. I'm like, I'm like can you, uh, and I need to- get the girls here at the table. <laughs> <laughs> bro, this shit, man. Sorry, 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 sorry chat, bro. All right. Um, Okay, so your question is... Yes, men are naturally attracted to women that are younger. Between 18 to 24 is universally what men find the most attractive. <coughs> by far. And this, they pulled this. They pulled men between 18 to 60. <laughs> and men of all ages universally find women between 18 to 24 the most attractive. <laughs> and for biology, they're more fertile. Yeah. Men see hips. I was gonna say. To waist ratio. All that stuff is like just way hotter. Than you, 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 and they're younger. more impressionable. Like, they don't have opinions and sit there and argue with you about they're, dumb shit. Like, I mean... They're not fully developed. Look, <laughs> I don't. I don't want to be an asshole or anything else like that. But I'm I'm significantly smarter than every one of you ladies at the panel. And you guys really? are sitting here trying to argue really? your worldviews on me, and I'm like, really? Shut up! You're dumber than me, so like, just listen. <laughs> but like, women try to sit here and argue Misogyny. with me, and I'm like, bro, Misogyny. like it's Misogyny. crazy because like, see, when I talk to men, right? Th- this is how men are. Okay, you're more accomplished than me. You're more intelligent than me. I'm gonna shut up and listen. Women, 
You guys think you're equal to a guy and your opinions matter. That's not true. They don't, bro. Why do you keep saying they you don't. guys? Yeah, you're you're so, comparing like, yourself you with a woman. You guys? The fact that you're internalizing what I'm saying generally spe- means proves my point. Opinion, then we're How? responding. I'm speaking in, in general. general. I didn't say you guys. I said women in general, but you're internalizing it. You're That's what I'm, that you precisely guys. proves my point. <laughs> I'm saying in general. Would, would that be Cassie? If she's a changed woman. But she's not. But you just said earlier, what if she don't change? Then no. How would you know? You know, you can tell when somebody's changed. You can't fundamentally. tell shit. I could lie to you all day. You would never know. Yes, I would. No, you wouldn't. Yes, I would. Portugal. All right. <laughs> it's the woman intuition. All right. What about right. you? Do you think? Do you think a woman that has a questionable past deserves her dream man? Um, me realistically, I'm gonna just say it's a double standard. So, um, nowadays people are willing to forgive a man. The man could be sat there and be ran through. To the to the T. Wait, what? Mm-hmm. The definition yep. of ran through, like you find ran through as a man. <laughs> ran through is just basically as like just woman. sleeping with anything with a hole in a leg. Okay. In legs, no. right. like we get ran through though. We we okay. do the runner. We ran. Okay. So <laughs> when know. it comes to a woman, it's like that value depreciates because of the simple fact that I'm like, oh, well, as a woman, you should have uh, exactly. you, you should value yourself. Oh, you shouldn't do that. Or you know, it's it's already that standard there. So even if she had a little fun here and there you know she's gonna be paying for it a little bit even if she wasn't like well put on the spot really. men don't get ran through by the way they run through okay yeah. so you know it's, it's different worse. yeah well you, you so are. you mentioned okay so you acknowledge that there's a so double standard so do you value. do you still think given the fact that you acknowledge that there's this double standard it seems to me like you agree with do you agree with that double standard I don't but it's just the reality of okay. it okay so do you think women with question past still deserve their dream man I just feel like realistically March. they're going to be judged period so it's yeah. just like I can't even say yeah or no it's just more of one of those things that where I'm going to just be like hey if you get it you get it if you Possibly. don't you don't <laughs> it's just one of those things to where yeah. if you if you done got the dude to suck like if you done suck this dude into getting with you then hey baby you won it's like <laughs> it is just it is what it is I'm okay All right. um, <laughs> if if you had um Let's say you were a bank and you lended out money, right? And um, people wanted to go ahead and borrow money from you, but they had really credit, shitty credit scores. Would you lend them the money? Ain't no banks out here lending nobody money. I'm sorry. It's just what it is. Okay, this is so a hypothetical, no. it's a hypothetical so no. question. No, if you had horrible credit, because that's what the world lives on, credit. You so so, so no. clearly the person doesn't get deserve to get their dream loan because they made bad financial decisions, right? I mean... <laughs> he got There's you. There's ways around it's just, everything. And like I said, it's a loophole <laughs> to everything. Right. So at this point, like if I said, you're gonna put it that way, yes, of course you're not gonna get money. So you, <laughs> you're not gonna get a second chance. L. Just hold the L. I'm gonna just hold Countries the L. Countries and this is two L's. <laughs> I'm gonna just hold the L at this I point. I feel like we're speaking about money, but when you talk about someone's dream man, what is your dream man? Your dream man does exactly. not have That's to what be saying. perfect. It's different from you can everybody. find your dream man yeah. walking on the street, and as long as he has two things, you're good. Mm-hmm. So in everyone's mind right now, you're thinking of the perfect man. A dream man doesn't have to be the perfect man you can be a whore and as long as you find a man who allows you to be a whore you're happy because that's your dream man Not so really. yes yes you are Not if that's really. the life you want to go through that's your life and i would say that's that i the reason why i disagree with that is whores tend to have some of the higher standards in men because they've had sex with so many different men mm-hmm. and they know what's out there and they've experienced it mm-hmm. they tend to have higher standards and want a guy that's top of the line but what they don't realize but is, have you messed with whores to know what their dream man is yes yes <laughs> hell yeah and does that devalue your value nah, nigga. as a, a man girl, a girl being uh, promiscuous or a man you being having promiscuous? sex with whores no no not at all so men can have sex with multiple women and it doesn't do anything to their value mm-hmm. i would argue it increases your value if anything wow. in what way why that's in insane eyes of whom in what way <laughs> That's insane. It doesn't. It doesn't increase the value. I feel like at if all. you meet your dream you woman or the idea of your dream me, woman, like, and you let her know oh. your body count, she would definitely walk away from you. Yeah. I think so. Yeah, I know. Yes, I know. Definitely. So. Okay, let's say your guy right now. You're engaged. Mm-hmm. He comes clean you. I've had sex with seventy five women. He what? I'm sorry. Let's he say comes he comes clean, clean you. He says mm-hmm. I've had sex with seventy five to one hundred girls. Mm-hmm. Are you going to walk away from that engagement? Well, that conversation would have to be hold had on. before hold the on. engagement. Okay, I on. use my brain, not okay. my feelings. But you, you think about it, right? You <laughs> contemplate it. <laughs> that question would never come. But after I'm saying the hypothetically. Engagement. Let's say he sorry. told you this. Hey, I'm coming clean. I'm sorry, but I've had sex with 75 to 100 girls. Right. Right now. Yeah. Yes. Tomorrow, uh, he tells you this. Come on. Six okay, months. you think about it. Cool. Six, Fair six enough. Months. She yeah. think about it. Now let's flip it. 
You go to him and you tell him, I got 75 to 100 bodies. You think he's sticking around? <laughs> he gone. Nobody is sticking around after Five. seven. No, that you, that, that, that on, amount of body counts. <laughs> I'm you, sorry. Do you not? Do, do I need to rewind the tape? Maybe yes. you do. Literally, <laughs> okay, I ask you, he comes to you tomorrow and says, I have 75 to 100 bodies. Right. You thought about it. Well, you said, Damn, you said what am hubby, I going to do? You said fiance, and I'm telling you the type of woman I am, that conversation would have been had before that. So that's kind I'm of giving like you a hypothetical. not fair. I'm yeah, giving you a hypothetical. He comes to you. Okay. okay. My he comes to you and says, I got 75 to 100. Mm -hmm. You're thinking about it. Mm -hmm. You're thinking, okay, is this really that big of a deal to throw off this engagement for this? However, mm -hmm. I'm telling you, if you went to him and you told him, I got 100 bodies, mm -hmm. he's probably going to leave you. The man That's I the have, difference. I no so one deserves so anyone. So you, that, you have to earn your moment, dream, Pop. If you don't, far, you don't have the dream, you don't deserve it. You didn't do what it takes to get it. It's your fault. It's like, do it again, Chris. What do you say? Girls. Girls, when someone's talking, please don't talk over anything. Just, oh my God, the time. Uh... No, okay, no one deserves anyone. You have to earn your dream partner. Why is it not playing? It should be playing. I don't know no one deserves uh, anyone. Go. You have to earn your dream partner. If you don't have the dream, you don't deserve it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you didn't do what it takes to get it. It's your fault. Okay. All right. Damn. Damn. Fair enough. Agree. Real. Yeah. That's fair enough. such thing as yeah. luck. I feel like yeah. the... I feel like I am the best person to answer Keeping this question, and only because of you. No one deserves anyone. The reason why you I have say to this earn because your dream like, partner. As as, like, a woman's if you don't have the dream, mm -hmm. you don't deserve it. You didn't do what like, it takes to get it. I started it's your sex fault. Like 15. Mm -hmm. So like my body count now I'm 22. So it's just like yeah I'm over that. Like you're gonna need at least an extra hand. Mm -hmm. Now my body. But let's be honest here. Who actually tells a person that they meet for the first time their body count? Nobody. The real, the real body count. Nobody does that. Nobody does I that. I do. I don't. Nobody does. Nigga. And if they do, they lie. Exactly. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. At the end of the day, yeah, when, we, when it comes to me, that. I'm just so raw I, with I this. Like, I'm gonna just tell you what it well, is. Hold on. Hold on. You guys are. Do you guys not see you're all proving my point? Women lie by body counts. They don't. You know. You would think about it if he told you I got a hundred, but if we switched it around, he probably want to stay with you. The, the reality is that like our values aren't the same. Mm -hmm. Of course not. But you're trying to, like, you guys, she's trying to equate a ran through man to, like, a ran through woman as if it's the same. Well, it's she ad not. admitted that it's a double standard, but she didn't like that it was a double standard. <laughs> yeah. I, I don't know. That's a touchy subject. Because I just feel like men think they can do whatever they want because they're created to do so, which I disagree. I mm -hmm. do feel like your value will decrease. I feel like Because definitely. of the amount of women you've been with. I'm well, sorry. Well, your own answer proves that it doesn't sorry. decrease. I just feel you like at the end of you this. No, because, because if... If he had, if he told you I have a hundred bodies, you would at least think about it. If you told him you had hundred bodies, it's questionable. Yes, it's okay, like, well, but you damn, think about it. But, why you didn't tell me that earlier? Okay, <laughs> you get what I'm saying. But you're willing to have a conversation. I'm telling yeah, you, if you told him you had a hundred, he'd mm -hmm. be gone. I don't think so. You know I'm gonna just be realistic. Hold Honestly, love, like, the yes, man they I will have, be, hold on, I don't think hold so. Hold on. Let's call him right now. Tell him, okay. tell him on the phone. Where's my phone? You got your bodies. Where's my phone? Let's do it. Bring your phone, he, ladies. He definitely would be like, bring her phone, ladies. Let, let him well, know. He's listen, not leave me because listen. Of that, I, I care about you so much, but I gotta be honest here, baby. I got hundred <laughs> niggas in my in my pussy. <laughs> okay, like does, he know, does he know you're on the show? Does he yeah, know you're on the yeah, he knows I'm on the podcast. Yeah, right now. I'm work. He's probably watching it. Is he watching? Yeah, he is watching. Yeah. <laughs> Wow. Alright, if he's watching it, that's why she's so confident. <laughs> 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 okay. Wait, so, so what is your body count? Seven. Hundred? Seven. Wow. You actually met period. someone who hasn't had seven hundred. I don't know who you've been sleeping with, but I have seven. <laughs> why not why not just get if if body count doesn't matter, why not just bang anyone you want? Because I'm in a relationship. No, I meant before that. And I also said in the beginning that I have a good head on my shoulders and I value myself as a woman. So, 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 okay, so you have some temperance, which ma ha makes you have a good head on your shoulders. I have some what? Temperance. 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 temperance? Sorry. Meaning like, that word. like modesty, know, like modesty. You, you know how to like <laughs> yeah. be chill and not be. You're making the argument mm -hmm. that body count doesn't matter like that. However, or, or you're, you're actually, yeah, you're making the argument that body count doesn't matter like that. But in your own behaviors and actions, it does matter because you've exercised some sexual temperance. He got you. He just didn't get me anywhere. Just I, just got think me. Maybe, I just think maybe you can rephrase the question and slow it down a little bit so I can understand. That's all I'm asking. Sorry. Okay. We got you. That's fine. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Um, I'm going to just be real. Okay. So we're going to just 
I'm going to just say that some, so it, it nowadays, uh, it people counting on, how many bodies. It doesn't matter. It depends on what the person is. You don't know live. what a person is willing to deal with until uh, you like, talk to them and tell them what it is. Exactly. That's true. Yeah, but, so, no, 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 but we're telling you for a guy, if you're going to tell him your body count and it's relatively high, even like 10 might be high for a guy, um, you don't know how he's going to react. But we can tell you off rip, his natural reaction is like, damn, ew. Like 10 plus bodies, this is kind of like, I don't know. But you agree right. that yeah. that's very double tender, too, right? It, it is. No, it really right? is. That's yeah. what I'm yeah. trying to say. And, 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 and my thing is, I just find it funny that you guys think, because uh, I'll give you guys my take on it. I don't think women that have questionable past deserve a good man at all. I don't even think women deserve boyfriends, really. Um, How? Oh, wow. 100%. That's, that's called that role. roles. That's called mm. roles. The man has a role, women has a role. Yeah, shut Period. the fuck up. Haram! <laughs> Shut up, bitch! Like, Listen, yeah. if I was like, your mother, I you would be so and, 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 and the woman's role is to not is is to follow the man and I understand agree. that your yes. opinion doesn't matter like that because the man is the final decision maker. And I think that's the way it's got to be because women are emotional and erratic. Look, yes. she's tuned out because of her emotions. Yeah, just get up and leave. By the way. Um, and then you, right? Yeah, it's, it's just, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's late. I mean, I, yeah. I agree with just the fact that with the fact that yes, men are the leader, and then we should, you know, we can give up, uh, we can give our opinion to the table. But you got to understand end, that your opinion can be deemed as irrelevant or not. It doesn't matter. It, so that happens. That happens. But that's sad on the man because you know sometimes women has other point of view Is that, that could make you look at things differently and could actually help you out. Have you heard about that? A good man, uh, what is it like? A, a, good, a good leader, woman, wife, a good leader. Ha, yeah, that that shit it really works out, and I have seen it not only once and twice or three many marriages were you that happy? are successful. In your marriage, were you happy? My man, my man, my ex husband had a very feminine energy, and I was a man for many years, and oh I God. I tried yeah, to I give up. Why, I tried I'm to give you, up to that the yeah. constant nagging. He was not Good a behavior. He was not a supportive man. He was not a provider. He was uh, just lacking many things that I had to take care I of. I thought it, money didn't right? matter. Bro, I have to. I have to feed my kids. Oh, what no, the no. heck? Oh, I never go. said I wanted to be poor. Hello. Personality. Hello. Hello. Personality. I don't need a palace. Oh. I do not need a palace to be happy. No. But I do. Ha I need to have oh, food. Congratulations. That oh. makes, yes. makes you yeah, like every other girl. Now you part of us? Congratulations. You, have, you just you made yourself not an exception anymore. Oh when the yappa yap, yeah. yap, yap, yap comes your, out. Yeah. 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 You are like You're another good. girl that You're wants good. a man to be a supporter, which is nothing wrong with that, by the way. I have been, and that's fine. Como se dice payasa? Payasa? Hello? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah you yeah. do realize you just defeated your entire thirty-minute <laughs> argument you just had. No, right? no. Yeah. What the heck? What? Oh, you mad now? No, I'm not mad. I'm just. <laughs>